So as you may guess, a student typically has played the sport they manage competitively. So I guess it makes sense that when asked why I would be the women's tennis manager specifically, it was pointed out that I do not necessarily have the build, as though I could never have been a tennis player in this life, my past ones, or the next. When I am inevitably seen wearing Harvard Women's Tennis merch, I've been stopped and asked by my own friends if I play, and before I could get anything out, had the question answered for me, saying that I spend way too much time in Elliott D. Hall to be an athlete. Unbeknownst to me, there were a few things that gave away that I am a non-athletic Harvard person. But I must say, after having my stature and time management skills attacked, I realized that these comments, though unprovoked, were not an affront to my character, but a testament to what it means to be a great Harvard athlete, to be a winner in every sense of the word. I watched in admiration on the court and in the group chat as they support one another in difficult times shift their lives to be good teammates, serve the community, and commit themselves to do early morning workouts. Between you and me, I could only ever muster up the energy to do one team workout at 10.30 a.m., but I, I, I will hold it very close to my heart, and if not there, then in my body, because I don't think I will ever forget that type of soreness. In short, I am truly honored and would be remiss if I didn't end with a string of thank yous so to my mom, grandma, and baby brother who are here this weekend, thank you. To the women who made my job easier and fun, thank you. Coach Green, Coach Kari, Dacia, I cannot tell you how much I'm going to miss the quiet satisfaction of changing the scoreboard after so often winning the doubles point. And I want it on official record that Debbie, I'm going to miss yelling with you all the time, so thank you for that. And Solomina, who was the manager before me, thank you, thank you. And to whoever left a Lululemon jacket among the pile of tennis merch that accumulated over the years that I grabbed on my first day to clean out the office. Wherever you are, I owe you my life.